Hi, I'm Azhar Damanwala. Hi, I'm Tanas Damanwala. Hi, I'm Jahan Damanwala. And this is Amchi City Fan Stories, powered by Stake News. My journey started in 2014, the same year when this club was formed. So basically, in 2014 April, I was in London, and I went to Manchester uh, to Etia to watch a game of Manchester City, and that's the time where. It was the first time that I even watched football. Like before that, I had no idea how many players are there on the field, what is the offside or what is the throw, and I had zero knowledge. And my friend, he took me specially, you know, because we were on a road trip, and that's how my journey started. Like you know, so when I was there, I always I was thinking like you know, I wish there is something back home, like you know, that I can go to the stadium, I can cheer, like you know, with the other fans for the team, for the players, and you know, I can proudly say, oh, this is my club, this is my city, like you know. And then when I came back, then there was an announcement of ISL coming up, and then Mumbai City happened, and I was like, wow! And then you know, Ranbir Kapoor being the owner, and the launch was there, which was huge, and that's how like my journey has started, like you know, from Man City to Mumbai City, MCFC all the way, and forever. Coming from a land of cricket, and then getting in football, which was not even like you know so popular at that time. It was there, but you you know you know in India is only cricket, cricket, cricket. and even i was like into cricket all the time since my childhood i was playing cricket only i was never into football but then it was just something i don't know it was the ethia the atmosphere and then the same atmosphere then i got it at home so you know i could i can still feel the vibes with me like you know when i go to the stadium and i see west coast brigade chanting and like you know that 90 95 minutes 100 minutes they are continuously chanting shouting the energy is not going down the energy is going up and up and the team the west coast brigade they are they are amazing they doing amazing work over there so the match day is basically like you know in the morning when you know it's okay the match and you're fully excited because in the evening i'm going to go for this game and you know like it's like i'm going to be shout i'm going to be chanting shouting with the you know with the fans i'll be there standing waiting for the players and everything and then dheere dheere the you finish your work and the evening comes like you know and then okay let's go let's go let's go and with west coast brigade like you know it's 5:30 5 o'clock when the bus is coming we go welcome the bus we welcome the players you know that's like a feeling like you know that cannot be expressed like you know so many players coming all the players coming and then you are standing there and you're waving at them they are waving at you they're happy we are happy and then when you go inside and the music starts the mumbai city anthem oh my god that's the best like you cannot go wrong with it like you know the vibes only as soon as the the drums start doom it's like superb bipin singh trust me achante is there everyone is there but i don't know i just love this guy because i see him running on the wings like this guy is like machine is like a bullet train for me i love him apuya is good chante is good they all are superb see i i, I cannot say this one is good this one is bad but i don't know somehow deep down in my heart i love bipin singh yeah i was very lucky thanks to the club and thanks to the management that you know for the launch of the, the the new logo that we recently had i got a good time i got a good photos with him i got a good chat with him and it was nice and the best part is like if you see this people this players they are so humble they are so down to earth like you don't feel like you know you're meeting a star you feel like ha ye to mera hi dost hai yaar like you know it's like so friendly they have no attitude they are so down to earth and they are talking so nicely i mean like they were just there for us like you know it, it felt like wow like you know because before coming i was like pata nahi yaar you know they the big players they are like you know maybe they will talk they will interact with us they will not but they were like just like us a fan like me I'm too old to play now but i have my son he's five and a half so you know i before he was born i had a dream like you know be a boy be a girl whatever is born i had a dream that you know i want him or her to play for mumbai city fc so that's what a local fan is like you know we want and even the team wants like the club wants someone from the local you know we have so many local players in our team now so that's what every fan wants like and that's how fans are important and the fans need to support the local club if we want see if we support a club in europe where we don't even stay so why not support your own home like you know this is my house and anyone who has not been to a stadium till now trust me i would just request them once just for once any game beat any any club against us just come once and you feel the energy be it a weekday be it a weekend sunday whatever and the energy will still remain the same so initially i remember the first time that he asked me to join him for a match and it was at andheri stadium and uh, it was like um, i'm like why why are we even coming here i honestly i knew nothing and then 
uh, when I sat with him and he knew his folks, and then there were these Mumbai city folks, the chanting, the it's, the whole atmosphere was different, and the vibe that was happening there, I was stunned to know that people had such kind of enthusiasm just for a game. So it was, and they just wouldn't stop. They went on and on and on. Honestly, this is a non. a football person who was experiencing it for the first time and i was zapped with the with the crowd with the energy of the crowd so then that made me go for the next time because i knew it was something exciting and then we kept going till we had him and then he joined us too see if you ask me about the club doing what they are doing i feel they are doing amazing like as you see right now is like the club is connecting with the fan yeah so you know that brings the fan closer more closer to the club Secondly if you see about the grassroots yeah we don't have an academy now but I'm sure city football will bring the academy but if you see the kids that they already have who have been playing like they have been DPDL or MFA or whatever they don't stop at 5 <laughs> they go till 10 12 15 they have amazing coaches like Raj Fedai and others who who teach the kids like okay you're not stopping your there is like you know you have to score keep scoring keep scoring they're making like how the city football group concept is that's what Mumbai is doing they are not making player they are making machines like you know players who know how to score who know how to play so wherever they play in whichever field they play they are going to be amazing like you know which wherever see all the players are not going to play for mumbai city fc i am sure city mumbai city will loan some sell some something or the other but they are making sure that each and every player is treated equal first of all and secondly they all have the same knowledge and same you know exposure to the game and to the strategies that they all work the best in their own abilities that's what i feel and the club is doing fantastic to come, uh, to connect with the fans to the community to the people around to bring the awareness and they are doing amazing like at the grassroots at the teenage at the main men's level everywhere the future is here the 